Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Courtney Ryan, and today we're talking all about men's hairstyles. So instead of just my opinion, I have a group of girls with me again here today that are going to be reacting to some different men's hairstyles and just giving you some insight on what girls like and what girls don't. So I also already did a video on my channel of men's hairstyles that I love and some results from an Instagram poll that I did, but I think it's interesting to just sit girls down and kind of have them explain why they like things and why they don't. And all these girls are very different, so it's normal that they're going to like different things. So regardless of what your hairstyle is, there is some girl out there that will love it. Before I jump into the video, I also did just want to say that 77% of you guys that watch my videos are not currently subscribed. So if you haven't already, be sure to like this video and hit that subscribe button to be in the loop for when I release new content. Enjoy the 23% of awesome people that already have. It really helps me out, which in return then helps you because then I can post more free, awesome content for you guys to watch. Okay, so this next segment is all about hairstyles. So just right off the bat, like what is your favorite men's hairstyle? I like um, kind of like buzzed on the side and like more full on the top and like styled with some gel. Okay, that's what every single girl says. It's so <laughs> funny. Like a little like short on the sides, a little bit longer on top. Okay. I mean, you can't really go wrong with that. But yeah. yeah, I've always been a fan of like, let me see a little spike. A little texture it's on top. It's just cute. Yeah, a little texture, honestly. I like the damper look. I like where they like, they, you don't have to do much, but like like the um little like, like a little pompadour? Yes, yes. The, I couldn't think of what it was called. I'm like, what is <laughs> they this called? They have crazy names. No, I yeah, have crazy um, names. I just think it looks classy and clean, and it's not over the top. I think that it's really nice when they have a little bit of flow. Okay. Like not like too much. Like a bro much. flow? Yeah. I like some hair. Mm -hmm. um, so you don't mind the long hair? No. Okay, I'm going to show you some different hairstyles, and I want you to tell me what you think of them. So same thing, reacting just like before. Okay. Number one, this is an undercut. I like it, yeah. Yeah, it looks clean, like he takes care of himself. Mm -hmm. I like this one, I think that these guys pull it off well and it's like balanced with the facial hair too. I don't know I, if, if these types of hairstyles are more work for men to keep up, I assume, than obviously like a buzz cut or yeah. something. Um, but it shows that a guy actually cares about his appearance. Mm -hmm. And some girls think that it makes them look like a pretty boy and they care, they're too into their looks, but I personally prefer a guy that actually does his hair. <laughs> yeah, I think guys think like having a grooming routine and doing your hair and stuff makes you feminine, but I think it can actually make a huge difference in the way that you look. And honestly, girls like that. I think it's nice and they're definitely into, you know, grooming themselves, whatever. Mm -hmm. It's good. Okay. I like this. Yeah? Yeah. Um, you like this better than the last one? Yeah. I do too. Yeah. I like the hair on the sides. Me too. But yeah, I think these are both good looks. The Clark Kent swoop. Yeah. Um, I love Zac Efron, so. Oh, yeah, don't we all? <laughs> so, he can do no wrong. <laughs> Anything Zac Efron wears looks good. Love. Super cute. Mm -hmm. I love it. <laughs> I think like... I don't know, caring about how you look, maybe not even in a vain way, but just like wanting to present yourself a certain way is very attractive. Definitely. Yeah. Def and it makes you stand out because a lot of guys feel like they can't. I feel like a lot of guys have been told their whole lives that it's like feminine yeah. to do that, but it's actually so much more attractive it to is. women to care about the way you look versus not caring. Right. Love these ones. These are really cute. This has been the favorite so far. Yeah. I don't know if it's because it's Zac Efron and that other guy is also really attractive. Probably. <laughs> but the hair just looks good too. It does, yeah. This hairstyle is good for guys that have like thicker, fuller head of hair for sure. Yeah. And then this one. I think this one's really cute too. Do you like the kind of messy look too? Mm hmm Yeah. Because it still looks kind of put together, but it's like more effortless. Yeah, I like this a lot. That's very cute. <laughs> I had a feeling. Yeah, I like the little flow. Mm -hmm. I like how he still has it. You know, on the sides it's shorter, but... Yeah. Do you like how it looks a little bit more messy? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I like that. I think compared to like the, the slick back look, I like it. Yeah. Messy hairstyles are cute on a lot of guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you gotta pull it off. You need that confidence with the with the band, the, the bed head. Kind of. Yeah, I feel like girls like that. The yeah. like messy, oh, yeah. kind of relaxed. Then they can put their fingers through it. I mean, obviously this is like a model, so he's super, like, this isn't gonna look good on everybody. Right, like he and it's, good with it's any. Sort of, it's sort of the look where it's messy, but it's supposed to be, so you have to still be able to style it, right? Yeah. What about the man bun? No, no. Hate the man I bun? I hate it, it's so gross. First of all, I don't want a guy who has the same hair as me. <laughs> no. 
and um, I don't want to have to like run my hands through your hair. Like right. that's so <laughs> that's no. as long it's as mine. It's super unattractive to me. I've never understood it. I don't get the the hype around it. And on top of that, a lot of men don't know how to take care of long hair, and so it just ends up looking greasy and disgusting yeah. all the time. <laughs> that is so awful. I love it. I love it. I have definitely convinced some of my guy friends to just go for it because like you said earlier, like they're a little apprehensive, like is yeah. this too feminine? No. Yeah. Some yeah. girls absolutely hate this and some girls love it. It's so interesting to see. Jason Momoa vibes. Yes. That's exactly who I was thinking yeah. of actually. Mm -hmm. What about a buzz cut? It looks nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I approve. I like that. It looks clean. It looks like he takes care of himself. Um, I definitely think there are a lot of guys that can like pull off a buzz cut. It just kind of depends. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes it can look like kind of like that high school sporty look. Yeah. So I think it just depends kind of how you like you dress too. Yeah. And do you think guys look better when they pick a hairstyle that's like more suited for them rather than just like what everyone else likes? Yeah. I mean, you have to do with like the shape of your face and the type of hair you have. Mm -hmm. That's nice. I think that looks good. Yeah, fade into the beard. Mm -hmm. That I like beards. Yeah, he's got some good like angles going on too. It just looks like he cares about keeping yeah. it clean. It's crisp. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do you think of bald guys? Um, yeah, it's not their fault all the time, but I personally don't like that at all. Okay. It's, I don't know. I really like a, a guy with nice hair. Mm -hmm. So to have none at all would be tragic. I think they're sexy. You gotta own it. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's a misconception too. Guys think that girls won't like them just because they're bald, but it's about the confidence that you have. I love bald guys. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Why? Um, there's a sophistication in it. Mm -hmm. I know a lot of bald guys that are like really attractive, so. Mm -hmm. Kind of just think shows it's... confidence and like working with what you've got. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm not a fan. Okay. I don't know if I can ever date a bald guy. My dad was bald. Once again, sometimes you just have to go for it. Yeah. Um, some people look amazing with the shaved head. I wish I could pull it off. I've noticed like uh, my friends who like bald guys, like only like bald guys. It's its own thing. Like, okay, it's, just it's like, like its a, own little community. It's a type, yeah. <laughs> okay, that'll give the guys that watch me some uh, a confidence boost for yes, sure. Yes, if um, you are bald, rock it, baby. I think so too, and do you think it looks better like if a guy has a receding hairline or he's losing his hair to just shave it? I think it depends. Like, I, I know that's really hard for guys. Um, so whatever they feel comfortable with. I agree. Yeah. I don't think I've ever looked at someone and, and been like, oh my God, look at that receding hairline. Or yeah. I'm just like, I don't and, know. And when it's your insecurity, work. you feel like it's all everyone right. sees, when in reality, nobody notices. And it depends. Um, some guys have the confidence to just line keep it line <laughs> lining up as it's going back yeah um and if you, it, it's about how you are exuding that confidence if mm -hmm. you're fine and then then i'm yeah, fine because you care more than anybody else mm -hmm. the girl's not going to care as much yeah. and if she does maybe not the right girl for you right just shave it i have a friend who had that and he just shaved it and he looks like 10 times better me now. too and he's like 25 and he shaved his head but he looks a million times better yeah he like rocks it now yep and it, it just does show confidence and that you don't really care mm -hmm. and like you said i've seen tons of guys look really good bald yeah oh to be bald yeah I agree. you have to just accept it because it, it's if you're trying to hide it it's really obvious that you're trying to hide it mm -hmm. so just accept it and shave it. And some people really can pull it off, so mm -hmm. it's fine, but. Yeah, like The Rock looks good with bald, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. But he would probably look good with anything. Have you seen him with hair? No. It's a thing, you should look it up. Wait, really? Mm -hmm, I weird. will have to. What do you think of gray hair? Do you think guys should embrace the gray or do you think they should dye it? I love it. It's like a weird thing Me that I too. really like. So my boyfriend actually, he start, I, he'll, you know, deny this forever, but, and he said it's because of me, which I'll take the blame. <laughs> um, but he's starting to get a lot of grays in, in the size, and I'm like all about it. I love it. Because if you can, you know, because he still styles his hair. And so if you have like gray hair mm -hmm. and you style it well, it can look so good. I would say embrace it, but I mean, do it makes you feel like your best, mm -hmm. but I don't think that they should like feel insecure about that at all. I feel like it's more so of a good thing. Oh, I like salt and pepper. Yeah. I do like salt and pepper. I tell the guys that all the time and I feel like they don't believe me, but I love it too. And every girl I've asked today has said the same exact thing. Yeah. So just embrace the gray. We want to hold on to our youth so hard. I that know. It's like. That you forget that honestly, it kind of, it looks good when you age gracefully. Absolutely. 
Oh yeah, um, because salt and pepper hair can be sexy. Mmm, like um, Max from Catfish. I like that. Yeah. I like gray hair. I do too. And every girl has said that. And I mm. feel like guys get so insecure when they start to turn gray, but it's actually such a turn on. All right, guys, that is all I have for today. If you liked this video or found it helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for when I release new content. Also, let me know in the comments down below if you're enjoying these style of videos. They're really fun to do, and I think it's nice to hear from some other ladies every now and then too. Also, if you haven't already, be sure to follow me on Instagram at Courtney Christine Ryan. I love connecting with all of you guys on there as well. I do a lot of Q and A's, and really, it's just the best place to connect with me a little bit more one-on-one. -on -one. So if that's something that you're into, be sure to do that as well. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all next time.